spiritual court has ruled that you received this financial blessing. Okay, it's been coming up in your other load, excuse me, prosperity, jackpot, success, good fortune, having plenty, money makers, sudden wealth, the real deal on easy street, okay, accomplishment, advantage, fortune, the prime source. Somebody's about to be mad, okay, this is what I'm saying, this this, this is literally what I was saying, because y'all not supposed to be single, y'all supposed to be in a union with your divine counterpart, your person, and this person, they, you know, they flopped, you know, the twin flop journey, you're really about to level up go up to the next level okay that's why this airplane is here rise up this spirit is about to shake the foundation of this earth if you guys do not receive the abundance or prosperity that you were supposed to have months or years ago i'm hearing spirit really is going to shake this earth like your enemies they may never see the light of day ever again y'all it's that serious so y'all gonna be compensated y'all y'all you know i'm gonna be honest you guys might be the single crazy cat lady the single crazy cat man living up in the mountains of virginia or something but at the least you're gonna be rich you're gonna be living up in a castle so whenever you feel sad or lonely go to the atm Pull out those $100 bills, okay? You see this? You see this, Scorpio? Pull out those $100 bills and wipe those tears with those $100 bills, okay? Cut. Hello, Scorpio. How are you? Welcome back to the channel. Starcy Zide here. If you're new, make sure to subscribe and join the Soul Tribe. We have a read for you guys, okay? This is uh, August 2023. General predictions, excuse me. <clears throat> it is a general read. So take what resonates and leave what doesn't behind. Crosswatchers, you are welcome. This message is also timeless. Personal reads are in the link tree link in the description box below for those of you interested. And with all that out of the way, we're going to get started. Thank you so much, angels, ancestors, spirit guides, universe, galactic beings, ancient ancestors, elders, guide us in this read for my Scorpios. What messages do you have for us? Truly grateful for your divine guidance and celestial lights. Okay, Scorpio, what is going on this month? Okay, we have Jupiter on the side, the Temperance card, and the Wheel of Fortune on the side. Sagittarius energy there. Here we have, uh, interesting, we have number nine upside down. So we also have number six, number nine, the Hermit card in reverse. And then we have number six. So that's the Lovers upright. Gemini, okay, and the Hermit Virgo. You could be a life path number nine or six your birthday could be on the sixth or the ninth of the month or the 16th or the 19th okay and then you have gemini on the side the lovers on the side the magician on the side mercury wanting to station direct and here you have mercury retrograde mm, that's heavy it's a heavy energy and i'm getting a lot of fro chakra block in your read scorpio so What's really going on here? Okay, we have main male at the bottom. <clears throat> oh, that's interesting. Wait a minute. Willow Smith, wait a minute. What's going on here? Judication. Okay. So we have main male and judication. Hmm. Scorpio, uh... There has been a spiritual court hearing here when it comes to you, okay? I do see that here. <clears throat> There's definitely also been black magic, uh, psychic attacks, evil eye, etc., etc. Karmic uh, people or karmic persons stalking you, sending attacks your way. Uh, I see here there has been a spiritual court hearing. I see here that the court hearing is still continuing, but... Um, there's been multiple court hearings here in the spiritual court, and they have ruled in your favor, almost every single one, basically. <clears throat> the fro chakra is so bad that, wow, unexpected. What is going on with these cards? Okay, unexpected income, may male dedication. Basically, what the spiritual court has ruled that you receive this financial blessing. Okay, it's been coming up in your reads for, for quite some time, but it's here again. There's just more uh, paperwork, okay, soul contract stuff that needs to be filed in the spiritual realm first. <clears throat> As above, so below. So 
once it's dealt with as above, then it will manifest itself so below. Okay, that's what's happening here. You're getting something about Rita's ice cream and Yo Play yogurt. Okay, so let's go here. What do we have? Yeah, we have Judication. I'm telling you, this month, a uh, final spiritual court hearing is going to be made on you, okay? Toil and labor. And then we have marriage, okay? Y'all... Y'all try to save somebody here. Okay. Y'all try to save your divine counterpart, but they they didn't want this, okay? You 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 are having to basically do this mission on your own is what I'm saying right now. You're basically doing this mission on your own, okay? Everything that you trained for this lifetime for this moment, you and your counterpart is like they have abandoned ship and now you're over here having to do this on your own. Okay, that's that's basically what I'm saying here. This is why you're being co uh, compensated. Okay, you're being compensated because of this Scorpio. Yep, gift. I'm 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 telling you, and courthouse is literally at the bottom. You're being given a gift. You're being being given the courthouse. Okay, but this is a spiritual court hearing because. You have somebody that you're supposed to be with right now, but you're not with that person, okay? Y'all not with that person. A lot of you have not come into that, uh, into union with that person just yet, and a lot of you were supposed to, okay? You were supposed to uh, a while ago. Y'all were supposed to have a union, marriage. By now, y'all were supposed to be married, okay? Y'all were supposed to be married quite some time ago. Pathway. Coffin, yeah. You're, you're going to be moving forward to the next level. It's going back to that last read where I was like, you're you're in the rocket ship. The rocket ship's getting ready to take off. It's going back to that last read, y'all. Bad health is here. <clears throat> Somebody is... Uh, some of you could be experiencing a loss, okay? So my condolences to y'all. Because somebody could literally be going up to heaven. If not, change. This is you ascending. Your read is very spiritual, Scorpio. Y'all about to be able to go out of body very, very easily. Uh, like I'm talking about, you could be sitting at home and you're just going to be able to project yourself out of your body. And you're going to be able to walk around. If you ever watched the Doctor Strange movie, ahem. <clears throat> Where, you know, once he learns how to project himself out of his body, he's able to just do it at will. Okay, if you've never seen it, definitely watch it. Um, it's a decent movie, but that part was really interesting. A lot of you are going to be able to do that. You're going to be able to start doing that this month. You're not going to, you're not going to need to meditate. You're not going to need to like be asleep to get out of your body. Um, this is you going through your ascension process. I'm saying here. Okay. This is a very spiritual read for a lot of you, okay? There, there's more spiritual emphasis in your read this time around. We have kerosene, okay? Airplane. And fork row. Okay, so something really is about to take off. You're, you're really about to level up, go up to the next level, okay? That's why this airplane is here. Rise up. Freedom. Breaking free. Okay, things work out. Taking off. Leaving it behind. Okay, forked road. You're going to have to make a choice this month. Do you want to continue on the same path or are you going to move forward? And honestly, I feel like ultimately Spirit wants y'all to move forward. So the kerosene is there. Just in case y'all decide that you don't want to level up, Spirit has a surprise for y'all. Okay, that kerosene, they'll cause a tower moment. <clears throat> Ooh, what's this? Person of fire. Okay. Uh, Y'all could have been de dealing with an Aries Leo Sage, okay? You, Scorpio. Okay, or you could have been de dealing with a, a Scorpio like yourself or another water sign. But this person's about to be mad, Okay. This person that was supposed to be on this chosen journey, yeah, because the mother load, the mother load, excuse me, prosperity, jackpot, success, good fortune, having plenty, money makers, sudden wealth, the real deal on easy street, okay, accomplishment, advantage, fortune, the prime source, 
somebody's about to be mad. Okay, this is what I'm saying. This this is literally what I was saying. You're y'all about to be compensated because y'all not supposed to be single. Y'all supposed to be in a union with your divine counterpart, your person. You have a specific person this lifetime that you're supposed to be with, and this person they you know they flopped. You know the twin flop journey. They done flop that one. Yeah, dynamite. I'm look. It's about to be a tower moment. I'm telling y'all. Look at this. Spirit is about to send the tower, and the tower is that the money that has been done has been delayed to y'all finally get to y'all because spirit is about to shake the foundation of this earth. If you guys do not receive the abundance or prosperity that you were supposed to have months or years ago, I'm hearing spirit really is going to shake this earth like your enemies they may never see the light of day ever again y'all it's that serious dynamite and thunderstorm is there look look what it says here power destruction trouble electric electric display a warning out of control okay triumph over evil energy shift okay opportunity to overcome dynamite excitement passion action suspense destroy okay Powder keg, fantastic, energetic breakup, catalyst for change. Okay, explosive, short fuse, firecracker, blast, sudden, unexpected, and fast. This is spirit. This is this spiritual court hearing. They have ruled. You receive the finances necessary, the opportunities necessary when it comes to your finances, so that you're able to move forward this August. And then balloons is there, freedom. Okay, fun, relief, rising up, ascension, okay? Why is somebody mad? Because they are stuck. They don't want to change. They don't want to evolve. They they just don't want it, y'all. You know, I know you I know a lot of you 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 have unconditional love, right? And M Kara is there. You have unconditional love for this person, a lot of you, but they they just don't they just don't want it, y'all. If if they can't see the vision this lifetime that spirit had for the both of you, then there's really nothing else you can do at this point. And, you know, somebody like somebody here is typing in their notes, like getting ready to send this person a message like love. They're not going to respond. Like, I'm, I'm just going to be honest, you know, Mars and Saturn are opposing each other. You know, this, we, we can't keep being in the fog here when it comes to some of these twin flame connections that we have gotten so comfortable in being in you know the the coldness the lack of communication ignoring you for months years on end you know at some point we have to put our foot down and demand better for ourselves and like i just see somebody here typing out in their notes app a message a long message thinking that this person is going to read it or that this person will respond to it. This person is not going to respond. Some of you, they're not even going to read it. Like, that's what I'm saying. They they just don't want it, y'all. They're, they're trying to, you see, an Amkara, an old car. They're trying to ascend, but with their old ways. Like, this individual would just drag you down. You have very likely here, okay? You're very likely to experience... Freedom, okay, this month of August, an ascension, okay, a timeline shift, some type of great opportunity, a great blessing, okay, something that changes everything with this thunderstorm card here. Mm. Yoga and master, some of y'all are going to be uh, yoga practitioners, yoga teachers, very interesting, very nice, okay, some of you are going to go get your certification, or that's what you're being called to do by spirit. Okay, what do we have here? The Three of Swords. What do we have here? The Three of Swords, the Page of Wands. And we have Main Female. This card was in this deck. Hierophant. What does this mean? What does this mean for my Scorpios? Nine of Pentacles, the devil. This twin flame has become possessed by the devil, okay? 
And they're basically trying to keep you on a karmic timeline so that you don't ascend. Okay, the devil has possessed this person I'm seeing here. And this is basically their plot, okay? If they can't destroy you or sacrifice you, then what they're going to do is try to do all this black magic and spell work so that you don't go on your soul journey so that you don't ascend. Okay, that's that's what this person is doing. The devil has full control over this twin flame of yours, Scorpio, okay? And they are being used by the enemy to basically delay your path as much as possible and even to destroy you on some level. Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, this individual is going around in the same cycle. The Magician is there and the Wheel of Fortune. Y'all about to manifest the opportunities that you guys have been waiting for, okay? The wheel is about to turn in your favor. This is divine intervention, okay, from the Most High God. This is divine intervention for you guys. God is about to involve himself here because this is getting out of hand now, okay? I'm getting, like, weird vibes from this twin flop. Okay, this fallen twin flame, this twin flame that fell from grace. I'm, I'm just getting weird vibes from this person. They be, they belong to some type of fraternity or, or some type of organization there with the Hierophant card. It, it, it's like they're in some type of group. Okay, this individual, uh, they're going to show up in your future in the Five of Pentacles because you have to leave them behind. And, you know, you may love them deeply. Right, because these connections are very intense and the five of cups is there. This individual may even beg you, but spirit is gonna block that for good. Cause where you're going, you you have learned the lessons, you have completed this cycle. Okay, this you know, this cycle has closed itself out, and now you're about to be victorious. Yep, I'm gonna get an American <laughs> I'm gonna get an Amex notification. So yeah, you know, credit limit like you know, the limit has been reached, basically. The time has run out on this divine connection. So better luck next lifetime for this person, if they even get that opportunity. The world, Ace of Pentacles, and the Ten of Pentacles. This is massive abundance. You're all about to be compensated beyond your imagination because of what has transpired here, okay? This is a robbery that has occurred. It is, okay? Y'all y'all were robbed. Of y'all's connection and this is why there's a lot of issues with love now because people are trying to pair up with people that have their own divine counterpart but then their divine counterpart isn't even available for them so then it's like this mismatch like all these people that aren't even supposed to be involved with each other like this is why dating is so traumatic now and karmic in a way because all these people that aren't even supposed to be together with the wrong person and then trying to build something with the wrong person. So y'all going to be compensated. Y'all, y'all, you know, I'm going to be honest. You guys might be the single crazy cat lady, the single crazy cat man living up in the mountains of Virginia or something. But at the least, you're going to be rich. You're going to be living up in a castle. So whenever you feel sad or lonely, go to the ATM Pull out those $100 bills, okay? You see this? You see this, Scorpio? Pull out those $100 bills and wipe those tears with those $100 bills, okay? Because y'all can have true love, but at the end of the day, you don't get paid to love. It's sad, I wish, but we don't get paid to love or to be in a loving relationship. We don't get paid for that. You know, love, love ain't going to pay the bills, that ain't going to put a roof over your head, okay? We we got to be real with ourselves here. Yes, love, light, and peace, but we're still in the 3D matrix. Like, we got bills to pay, and ain't nobody trying to deal too much with work, okay? Back-breaking work because, you know, retirement is still years away, you know? Ain't nobody trying to deal with that, trying to break their back at work, trying to slip and fall, bust their hip or something, and then they miss out on their retirement, you know? So, at least... When you receive this money, understand that you are in a very good financial position that many people wish they could be in. You know, some people may never get this opportunity this lifetime, but you are getting this opportunity. I know it's, you know, the love thing is, it, it sucks. Like, let's, let's be honest, it does. But try to be grateful, right? The attitude of gratitude, as they say, Seven of Pentacles, because you're going to be able to have a peaceful 
relaxed life up in your farm, up in the mountain, okay, or in a really nice neighborhood, okay, wherever it may be, off on the island, okay, some of you are going to return back to your island or something, mm, the chariot and the tower, yo, I'm telling y'all, spirit is about to send some destruction, because this past energy, the, this past life, twin flame, soulmate, they're over here acting the fool with their parties, okay? Three of Cups, High Priestess, and the Ten of Swords. And all they're trying to do is slow you down. Thinking that there's going to be a union. Four of Wands, Two of Cups, and the Knight of Swords. When the Page of Swords and the King of Pentacles is there with the Three of Pentacles, they have already invested with this third party. They already invested. That's who they want to collaborate with. They felt like this third party had the finances. So this is a betrayal. This, this, you know how like they have those high level crime cases on the TV, like high level. This is the case with y'all. Y'all's case is high level because your twin, your person was not supposed to get involved with no third party karmic this lifetime. They didn't have a karmic contract this lifetime. They had already done that in a previous lifetime. They didn't have to fulfill no karmic contract this lifetime. And who really wants to sleep with somebody that has been sleeping with a crazy karmic? You know, all that distorted, demonic energy attached to that person. Like, who who really wants to, you know, like, it, it, it wouldn't be me. I mean, to each their own, but I, I don't know. But that's your read. That's what I have for you. I hope you enjoyed this. I wish you the best of luck, and I wish you love and light. Take care.